Right already, we have officers down. Sir, can you give me any specifics at our location? Galley in Murray, the Murray Hill apartment. Folks, Andrew McMillan with KRDO News Channel 13. We are live out at Galley and Murray Road, where there is heavy police activity here in the east side of Colorado Springs. Now, as we reported and we sent out a push alert just moments ago, there are reports that several Colorado Springs officers are down. Now, this isn't confirmed. Police are sending a spokesperson right now. But as you can see, the presence is very heavy. You can see there's Colorado Springs police, there's also deputies, there are state troopers, El Paso County Sheriff's Office out here. They have the area blocked off as well. So as you can see, this is Galley and Murray right here, and it is blocked off all the way as far as we could see. Now we're trying to get some more information, but let me show you what we can see here, is that we've got a lot of activity here at the Emory Apartments, but it could also be at the Murray Hill. As I was coming up to the scene, I saw a lot of police activity towards the back of the apartment complex. Now I'm going to try and run there now to see if there's still that going on. But as you can see, the main police activity is all along Murray. All right, I'm going to try and fix that microphone. We're going to try and get the best microphone quality that we can here. If you can't hear me, please speak up. And I will go ahead and unplug the microphone here. But coming over here, as you can see, there's even more activity behind. And it's all back there. So as you can see, there's a lot of police activity going on in the back of this apartment complex. And we're trying to figure out exactly what's going on. We've got some officers here that have blocked off the entrance. They're not letting anybody in just yet. They're not getting us any information just yet. So this is an ongoing scene. The traffic here on Galley itself is a little, it's starting to ease up a little bit now as people are getting the message, but it is still backed up. Sierra, no, those are not gunshots. No, there are no gunshots that have been fired since we've gotten here. Like an exo officer down, Galley and Murray, Galley and Murray. I don't have any further yet. We're starting medical. How many? We also have a couple of suspects down. We need multiple ambulances. It is, uh, is with profound sadness that I say that this afternoon, Deputy Micah Flick, 34 years old, was shot in the line of duty and has died. Micah is survived by his wife and seven-year-old twins. Today was his 11th anniversary with the Sheriff's Office. His current assignment is as a detective in our investigations division, but he has served on, in the jail at CJC's floor security, in court and transport, with our special response team and on patrol. He was hired February 5th, 2007. 34 years old, born August 20th, 1983. Deputy Flick was an outstanding member of my agency and he will be missed. Galley and Murray, Galley and Murray. I don't have any further yet. We're starting medical. 